Hi everyone, welcome to Civil Engineering Tutorials. In this video, I will show you how to use T circle command in AutoCAD. So if you are new to my channel, then click the subscribe button and the bell icon to stay updated with all new videos. Also, don't forget to follow me on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter to get all kinds of updates. So let's get started. So here I am. I will show you how to use T circle command. So shortcut key of T circle command is TCI. Now TCI press enter. Now it's asking to select objects. So here we have some objects here. I have created some text. So I will select this text because I need to cover this with T circle command. So now after selecting press enter. Now it's asking enter distance offset offset factor. So distance offset factor it's not the radius of circle. Okay, this is not the radius of circle. Distance offset offset factor means according to your text size how much area it will cover with a spe specific offset distance. Here you can see this is a a1 a12 door. 4 feet 0 inch into 7 feet 0 inch window block A12. So different sides of text I have created here. So you have to cover this with the T circle command. So how what is the offset distance you will give? So according to that the area it will cover with a specific offset distance. Okay. So I will keep it. 0 0.35 it's by default or you can change it also I use I, I will keep it 0 0.35 it is by default so press enter now we have three options circles slots rectangles you can cover by circles first I will show you circle now again two op options constant and variable so first let's see what is constant constant so you can see so constant means all circle sizes are same. You can see all texts are different. Big and small text but circle size is different. Okay. So the text which is bigger according to that circle will be created. Okay. So this is the bigger text block A12. So according to this all the circles are created. Okay, so the text which is bigger according to that only the circle will be created. This is constant. Okay. Now here I will show you by checking the radius. QDIM. Press enter. Now select the circles. Enter. For radius R. Enter. And click here. You can see all circles diameter uh, sorry radius 10 feet 5 inch. Okay. So distance offset factor means according to your text size how much area it will cover with specified offset distance and constant. Uh, we have taken constant that means all circle sizes are same and the text which is bigger according to that circle will be created. Next, again TCI, press enter. Now, select objects. I will select only these four objects. Press enter. 0 0.35 only. So, press enter. Now, circle, constant. Here you see, this is the bigger uh, word, door. Okay. Three letter word, door. Sorry, four letter word, door. So, according to the door, according to this, the door word, the, this is the bigger one. So, this text is bigger. So, the text which is bigger according to that circle will be created. The circle is created as per door. See, all the radius are same, same 6 feet 4 inch. Okay. So, according to this text, this word all the circles are created. So text which is bigger as for that only all the circles are created. So hope you understand how to create circle with 
constant now again tci press enter select objects press enter distance 0.35 circles constant now this is this is like you can create constant circles now tci press enter select objects and select this objects press enter here 0.35 now uh, suppose i'll take 0.9 press enter now i'll take circles and constant you can see the space here increased okay the here the increased distance offset factors and the offset distance increased you can see here offset distance increased because we have given offset distance 0.9 okay we have increased the distance offset factor so the offset distance also increased here here this is the offset distance here the this is the offset distance so if you will increase the distance offset factor then the offset distance will be increased automatically okay so hope you understand now i will delete this next tci press enter select object i will select these objects press enter again now i'll keep it by default 0.35 press enter circles now i will constant we have done i will show you variable so select variable you can see variable we have selected that means it will create different sizes of circles as per each single text size look small text small circle bigger text bigger circles okay so variable means it will create different sizes of circles as per each single text size you can see the difference between constant and variable now these circles uh, this text i have created so tci select object i'll select these objects so press enter now enter uh, offset factor distance uh, 0.35 now slots select slots now constant first here we have some options width height and both so first i'll select width okay now you can see here width is selected that means it will create slots with equal width and it will differentiate the heights okay so we have selected width we have created slot with selecting width you can see this is the width this is the height height is different this is 4.4 feet 4 inch and this is 4 feet 4 inch but this is 4 feet 3 inch because we have selected width so width is selected that means it will create slots with equal width but it will differentiate height 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 is different you can see all heights are different but if i'll check width here to here it is 21 feet 3 inch here to here it is also 21 feet 3 inch so width it will uh, slots are created with equal width okay and heights are different so this is the meaning of con uh, constant and width we have selected again tci select object i will select these objects press enter now 0.35 slot now constant now i'll select height this time height select height now you can see this time i have selected height that means it will create height is selected that means it will create slots with equal height and width it will differentiate the width okay height 4 feet 4 inch here also height 4 feet so i have selected the height so it will it created the slots with equal height but widths are different okay all heights are same 
फोर फिट फोर इंच पर बट विड्स आर डिफरेंट यू कैन सी डिफरेंट विड्स ओके होप यू अंडरस्टैंड सो अगेन टी सी आई सिलेक्ट ऑब्जेक्ट प्लस एंटर आई सिलेक्ट दिस ऑब्जेक्ट जीरो पॉइंट थ्री फाइव सो प्लस एंटर ना स्लॉट्स कॉन्स्टेंट ना आई सिलेक्ट बोथ ओके बोथ ना यू कैन सी आज बोथ हाइट एंड विथ आर सिलेक्टेड ओके सो इट विल क्रिएट इट बोथ द हाइट्स इट विल क्रिएट स्लॉट इज क्रिएटेड विथ इक्वल हाइट एंड इक्वल विथ ओके स्लॉट्स आर क्रिएटेड विथ इक्वल हाइट एंड इक्वल विथ सी इट इज फोर फिट फोर इंच ट्वेंटी वन फिट फोर इंच एंड दिस साइड दिस इज ऑल्सो फोर फिट फोर इंच एंड दिस साइड ऑल्सो फोर फिट ट्वेंटी वन फिट फोर इंच सो आज वी हैव सिलेक्टेड बोथ हाइट एंड विथ सो इट फिल इट क्रिएट इट क्रिएट्स द स्लॉट्स विथ इक्वल विथ एंड इक्वल हाइट अगेन स्लॉट्स सिलेक्ट दिस प्लस एंटर जीरो पॉइंट थ्री फाइव प्लस एंटर स्लॉट्स नाउ वेरिएबल सो क्लिक वेरिएबल ओके सो वेरिएबल आज आई हैव सिलेक्टेड इट विल क्रिएट डिफरेंट साइज ऑफ स्लॉट्स एज फॉर ईच सिंगल टेक्स साइज यू कैन सी it will it it will create if you select variable it will create different size of slots as per each single text size so hope you understand what is the di uh, different difference between uh, constant and variable again tci now select object press enter 0.35 press enter now i'll check rectangle select rectangle constant and width now width is created now i have selected width so width is selected that means it will cre create rectangles with equal width now again tci select uh, object 0.35 rectangles constant height so height is selected that means it will create rectangles with equal heights and it will differentiate the width here it will differentiate the height as width is created here it will differentiate the width as height is selected okay now again tci press enter now select object now constant both so here you can see Here you can see again TCI select object now press enter zero point three five now rectangles I'll take variable so variable means it 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 created different size of rectangles as per each single text size okay so hope you understand. Now again, TCI select object, press enter zero point three five. So simply press enter. No need to give again. Suppose zero point eight I have given. Then rectangles, constant, width. See the distance here. As I have increased the distance offset factor, so the offset distance increased here. You see the difference. Okay, I have increased the distance, so distance offset factor increased here. So hope you understand. So when you have some text on your project and uh, you want to cover it with circle, slot, or rectangle, then you can do it by using T circle command like this. So hope you like this video, and if you find this video helpful, don't forget to 